is October 16th, 5.44, and I have just made it home <laughs> from a very long Monday. We had a break last week, and to tell you the truth, I am exhausted. I'm really exhausted. <laughs> um, you know, I was uh, prepared for less than today in the week, and wow, I'm just like, whoo, Monday, here we go. Let's do this. I can make it. It's going to be a really harsh week, but I think I can make it through. Uh, I've just got a lot going on. It's, it's just, it's going to be nuts, but we're going to make it work. We can do this. It's doable. But uh, the reason I am jumping on here is I have just gone home from the grocery store, went to Starbucks, of course, got my coffee for the morning, but then I'm going to start making my coffee this week, I think. I think I want to start taking a break from getting coffee, so I'm going to unload the stuff. I wanted to get all unloaded and show you what I got because I got a lot. And I usually what I do, or what I like to do is go change into my comfies. But I'm like, okay, I need to get everything unloaded and just show the haul, get it picked up, and then I'll go change because I am burning up. What I'm wearing today, I'm hotter than Nobody's business. Okay. I'm trying to make this work, doing it with one hand. I got a lot of goodies. Probably some that I shouldn't have got. But I'm like, I need it. I need it for the week. But... Who cares? Who cares? Okay. I am just unloading all this so I can just kind of turn you all around, show you what I got. Woo! This is what I get for trying to hurry. Oh, I'm so hungry as well. I'm starving. I'm gonna have my, uh, did I not get peppermint creamer? Did I not? I got a peppermint mocha. I didn't get a peppermint creamer. Dummy, crap, 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 crap. I did not get a peppermint mocha creamer. Well, wait, I think I have one. Yeah, I have one. I've got until January anyway. Okay, we're good. We're good. I was panicking there for a second. I was like, doggone it, I forgot something. Okay. That's usually me. I usually forget something. Okay. And here are the dips. Cause I'm like, I may be really hungry for some Mexican food, dip, and chips. Did I get chips? Did they not give me my chips? Oh no, oh no, there's, there's several bads over there. Okay, <laughs> I'm just like, oh my gosh. This is nuts. I'm nuts. And I'm like, I need payday. And I have this week to end with. I need payday so badly. So badly. Ugh. Okay. I'm going to have to put y'all down because I'm like, I can't do this all by hand.
It's a cat. And I'm like, have I even told y'all what's going on? I think I have. I don't know. But this week I got Art Club is going to be helping with the elementary fall festival carnivals. Thursday, well, Friday and Saturday. 5 to 7, 12 to 3. And I'm oh, using my jeans here. Um, I had to help since I'm part of the Art Club sponsor. So we are doing face painting as a booth. And they're going to provide, one of the elementaries is providing the face paint, the other I don't think is. But we've got some, so we're good on that. But uh, also, it's the same weekend as my mom's um, craft show, which is here in town, and it's called the Running Water Draw. Well, I was going to sign up and help her with that this weekend on the account of that I didn't know that I was, you know. So I'm going to be being two duplicate people at once. But we're going to make it work. We can do it. We can do this. We got this. Okay, let me show you what I got. Oh, I can't talk. Here is my vast array of options for this week and to drink and to chomp on, which I will be. My Santa Fe chips, my yogurt for breakfast, my zero sugar Dr. Pepper, Canada Dries, pear, peach, mineral water to drink as well um crackers breakfast bar dip like chewies whole grain wheat thins uh gouda cheese pimento cheese a pasta to eat lemons for water strawberries blueberries blackberries all that goodness Olipop Classic Root Beer, Planet Oat Milk, Sparkling Cranberry Water, Peppermint Mocha Coffee, Vanilla Latte, Caramel Sweetener to put on top of my coffee, Peppermint also, pepper, Pumpkin Spice Latte, and my Planet Oat Milk to have with my coffee as well. So that is all of my goodies that I have, plus my sweets and I also got a really good looking sandwich to have at some point in the week yes this is my bare refrigerator don't you think it was about time to go to the Dane store I mean seriously hello that's my refrigerator it goes off on me okay I have candy corn. I also have, like I don't have enough sweets on the table. I mean, come on now. Chocolate, Nerds, Clusters, m &Ms, Caramel Apple Pie Suckers, and to add with it, cupcakes. You think I'm needing some desperate sugar right now? Because you think I'm on a sugar high right Okay, here is my final a date of my refrigerator. It is now completely filled. I am now all set up and ready to go. Okay, girls, you'll probably recognize these. These are face masks and eye masks that you can use as well in the refrigerator. You can place in the refrigerator because there is called a thing of a skincare refrigerator, which keeps everything cold. Okay, I am all set to go for dinner. I am going to get changed and out of these horrendously hot items because I'm burning up. So I am right now heating up my leftover quesadilla that I had on Saturday and a pizza that I had on Friday when I was home with my parents for the fall break. And if anybody 
doesn't want to have to use a microwave anymore, this is this is it. Because these are, are amazing. These are awesome. I hardly ever use my microwave now. I use this thing to reheat my food and it tastes like it came just right from the restaurant. It's amazing. I usually don't cook it above 325 anymore because I felt that was too much. So I do about 320 at seven minutes and it usually is doggone good when I start eating it. It just tastes like it came just right from the restaurant. So good. But yeah, this is what I am having. And I am, do I want to use a plate or do I just want to use a paper plate? I think I may just use a paper plate. I do not want to have to wash any plates. Ouch. You can hear it sizzling. I'm trying to decide what I want to have as far as dip goes. If I want to open my dip or if I just want to have my sauce. I don't know, it might have to be an afterthought. But yeah, I'm just waiting on my food to cook. After a long, hard day at work, I do like to come retreat into my living room and watch some TV. I am really into suits right now, and I also like watching other YouTubers. And I usually get some ideas off of their YouTube channels to put on my YouTube channel. You know what? I may cut it down because it looks pretty done. Sometimes you can call it off earlier than expected. Let's eat. Good evening, everyone. It is October 24th at nine o'clock and I am staying up tonight working on another project for my Art One class. We are working on concentric and echo lines. So the assignment was where the students had to come up with five Halloween objects and they had to choose a color scheme, and mine is warm and cool colors in the background. And I did a Mickey Mouse pumpkin, a poison apple, potions, a pumpkin cupcake, and a witch. And uh, I'm trying to think of anything else I can add to this that uh, was the assignment. But they had to also make sure that their lines were not the same colors so that they did not touch. But that is what we are working on. Echo and concentric lines for color. Color is always my favorite assignment. I don't know why, but I just love it when we start doing things in color. And I am using... I thought at first that I was going to hate these color pencils because they're cheap, but they are from Michaels and they're called watercolor pencils artist loft. And so far I am like loving these. They sharpen well, but they're sharpened pencils. They are wooden and they have a, a ragged round edge, which is really nice to hold and comfortable. So I am really enjoying these. Good evening, everyone. It is October the 26th at about 7.15. I'm just about to wrap up another night. And it is Friday tomorrow. 
So I am very excited about that. Today we had to do an art club field trip where we went to the Luca Printing Center in our Metro Plats, about an hour away. And we had a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun hanging out with artists and getting to create. Um, anyway, I want to come on here and kind of explain the situation. Um, I am not going to be home a whole lot for the next few weekends to come. And um, I'm not going to get to enjoy my Christmas decor if I don't put it up right now. So I'm giving you this last video of my fall decor that I had done. And just letting you see the last of it because all of this is soon to come down because I am going to be decorating for Christmas. It is literally going to be Christmas in October, the Nightmare Before Christmas theme. So it is going to be what it's going to be and I'm just going to decorate and have fun. But as you can tell, I am very, very tired. It's been a long week. Lots of things to come up in the next few weeks. And this weekend, besides decorating for Christmas and dusting and going to the grocery store and the first freeze that we're supposed to have Sunday, it's going to be below 30s. Um, besides all that, I've got Saturday, another carnival to do, another face painting for another elementary school for the art club. So I will be busy from 12 to 3. So that will be, that will be that. And then I can enjoy the rest of my weekend. Like I so need to, because I am so tired. <laughs> I, I, I could barely get up this morning for today. But I was excited to go on the field trip. It was a whole lot of fun. Learned a lot. Excited for uh, the next coming year. Hoping that we can take more students on this uh, field trip. Because it is so worth it, I think, for students to experience the real world of how printing works. And how the printing press. And just get in your hands experience on doing the potter's wheel and working with clay i think the students really enjoyed all that and i just i don't know i look forward to increasing and hoping to take more students in the years to come if the world keeps on going and if it doesn't that's okay but uh and if i keep on teaching <laughs> um yeah i'm always threatening about stopping the teaching job but that never happens anyway um besides all that um what else was i gonna say i can't even remember but i i am so sorry i have been kind of mia for the last few days i just i really haven't been in the mood to video <sighs> but anyway um i got over a thousand photos today on the camera for this field trip. So it'll be really a lot of fun to go through those photos, edit those when I had the chance for the weekend. And we got a swag bag, which I'm excited that we have received. Really neat when you go on a field trip and you get a swag bag, that's really cool. Uh, but got some laundry to hang up, more laundry over here probably wonder what that bag is that bag is full of treats to take on conference day when we go to Dallas. Dallas, i can't talk dallas but um right now i'm just about to wrap up the evening i had washed my sheets and i need to make my bed and i'm getting cold again so i had to turn on the heater it just gets cold in the evening. I just get so incredibly cold. 
towards the time that I get up in the morning at 5 30 a.m. it just gets so cold like in the 60s there you can see me there I'm really bright and shiny but yeah over in this stack of menagerie I've got tons of laundry to wash and I need to clean my bathroom I need to dust my mom bless her heart uh past weekend when she came for the running water draw craft show that monday before she left bless her heart she spent the morning cleaning for me she vacuumed she just made it when i came home i felt like i was at a luxury hotel everything was just set out it was just <laughs> i just felt incredibly spoiled and i am incredibly blessed to have wonderful parents who take care of me i love you mom watching out there but she doesn't like to dust, so I get to do the dusting part, but you know what? I am really not going to go in deep depth of dusting. I just don't feel like it's that dusty, so I'm just going to swift for dust. I'm going to just do the plain basic kind of dusting so that I can get my Christmas out, get that decorated. Then I can show you a cool video of getting decor out, and I will try to video that. I want to try to be really good and try to get at least three videos up. This weekend, we'll see what I can get done. But you think I'm, yeah, I look really tired. I look like a ghost. I look like Halloween right now. Uh, but yeah, I, I'm, I'm very tired. Friday, tomorrow. I'm trying to figure out my weekend a little bit because I've got so much that I need to get done. So little time to do it because Friday after school, my bug lady is coming to spray my house for buds. And then Saturday, I have a face painting thing, carnival to go to, 12 to 3. And then after that, I'm free. But Sunday, it's going to be cold. And I don't want to get out that day at all. So I need to get things done Friday and Saturday so that I won't be having to get out in the cold. Although... The thought of getting a Starbucks on Sunday morning, getting it really hot, sounds extra kind of fun, but we'll see. We'll see how that goes. But I need to make my bed, and I need to get ready for bed so that I can get up in the morning and do the rig and roll, and then my weekend starts up, and yeah. So I'm going to say good night. And I hope everybody has a wonderful, blessed week and weekend. And I hope to video some more footage and get it up for you so that you can enjoy. But I am sorry that I haven't been consistent. Um, here throughout, I'm going to try to be consistent. I do have some things coming up. Uh, next weekend, my mom and I get our nails done and it's Christmas Roundup. So we're going to go to that. The next weekend, we get our hair done. And then, then the next weekend, I head out to conference. So I will try to get footage of that. I am I am like full-blown going to get footage of conference. I'm just going to say, hey, ladies, I've got a YouTube channel. I'm trying to get footage for my for my videos. Um, <laughs> two, of my, like, two of my coworkers know about my YouTube. So I'm hoping they will allow me to video some of our girl time so I, I pro they probably think I am wild and crazy for doing this but you know um some of my subscribers out there are my kids and I really kind of it, it pushes you to keep going when your kids are interested in your videos and you just think oh wow okay I'm I'm, I'm getting there I'm getting past of 100 I'm getting to 122 and I want to grow and I want to get better and when you know so I will just keep going keep pushing keep doing this even though my videos aren't the most exciting luxurious things that I wish I could do but I, I try to make them as fun as I can and we'll just see where it goes and I've got some video ideas to do I will at some point, boys and girls, give you a book recommendation video. <laughs> it's just a matter of videoing it. I just don't have time. Um, and uh, 
a get ready with me. Maybe I can do a get ready with me this weekend as well. And what else? Um, gosh, I, I, I'm, I've got some ideas, but I just need to get them done. And I'm blabbering. I need to stop blabbering, and I just need to close out, begin a new fresh day. It's Friday is tomorrow. Maybe I can feel good enough to video a get ready with me school edition and we'll see how it goes so i'm going to say good night and i will see you in the next